Yeah, that one. Okay, everybody, welcome back. This is the addendum training. Our first example um, is an addendum where um, the client is going to get approved for financing. We have interest-free, 36-month interest-free financing. Um, and so this is the example. It's still Adam Smith. We're still finding all the numbers in the same spot. As you know here on the addendum, their name, number, claim number, important, address. Um, this will already be pre-made up for you. All you're going to have to do is implement their deductible, which you'll find right here on the summary page of the estimate from the insurance company. Um, the approval code you'll get from Wells Fargo and the Wells Fargo app. This is obviously the what we're giving him, 36-month interest-free financing payment of, if you take this amount divided by 36 months, gives you how much it is per month that they'll make a payment on. This is an awesome program. And here's how the rest of the addendum will look. This, all this information will be blank on your addendums. Um, but for this example, this is how to fill out Adam Smith's, the one we've been following through the process. First, the replacement cost value. We know that we can find that here on the summary of dwelling. Remember, that's the biggest number on the contract. I want to put that there. Depreciation, we write that right here. And this is where we find that. It says replacement cost value, less depreciation um, is that figure as it matches up. The next is the actual cash value right here on the summary of dwelling. That's the number matches up to here. The deductible, real easy in parentheses, the next, the second parentheses item means it's deducted initially. Um, and the insurance actual first check, or they call it the net claim on the summary for dwelling. And the total job cost, since they are paying their full deductible, everything will match up. The one thing you will see here is this statement, which is true, plus any approved supplements by the insurance company. And so what that that means is that anything fairly and factually forensically owed additional that they might have missed on the original estimate, we are um, available to have to get those funds as well. Here you'll see a statement: no other money out of homeowner's pocket besides deductible agreed to be pay to pay and rotted wood not covered by insurance. So we provide two pieces of 4x8 OSB if we need it. Anything above that that the insurance company will not replace due to hurricane damage, which would probably be rotted wood for an extended period of time. Um, the storm only happened you know, a couple months ago or within a six-month span, and they can tell how long the rot typically has been there. So we try and do the best we can to get all the wood covered that needs to be damaged by the hurricane. Obviously, the next spots is the property uh, owner's name, their signature and date, your name, signature and date. And uh, that is how you fill out an addendum with financing from Wells Fargo.